you like emotes and want them flying on your stream, including the animated ones from Twitch, when somebody posts them in the chat. I am Radu and I will show you today how to add the emote wall for your streams that supports uh, Twitch normal and animated emotes, but also YouTube uh, normal and members, as well as kick. Welcome everybody and this is how we will gonna be doing it. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna open a browser and we're gonna go to realityripple.com and over here there is the emote wall, this is what we are interested in right now. I'm gonna click on it and we're gonna click the download emote wall version 1.1. After clicking it, I strongly recommend you to go with a wizard easy config instead of manual config. Uh, this will gonna be uh, a bit harder because uh, if you want to change some uh, settings inside the emote wall, you won't gonna be able to do it. You're gonna have to uh, actually get in the code and know exactly what you're doing there. Otherwise, you can actually break it. So go with a wizard with an easy configuration, and here you're gonna be redirected to another page where you can actually. Uh, Check how we're gonna look basically the emotes uh, on a screen or let's place it on black because it's easier to be seen. And over here, there is the emote size. The more you go on the left side, the smaller they will gonna be. The more you go on the right side, the bigger the emotes will gonna be. So choose your preference uh, as you like. I think every anything that it's uh, the tenth of uh, the screen looks pretty good maybe just a bit bigger and also the display time i like uh, the display time to be a bit longer because uh, i like my emotes to stay on the screen a bit longer when they are using so they are going to be more animated and then you will gonna go and uh, click on the youtube icon over here or twitch depending on what platform are you using or if you're multi-streaming click on both so over here you're gonna have uh, like celebration emotes and you want to uh, select which ones you want to have because for example you want to get a follow some random emotes will gonna pop up from uh, the bottom of your screen and I like them to be uh, placed on everything except prediction pools maybe also shoutouts and then I'm gonna click the authenticate on Twitch button so it'll gonna be authenticated and after that, you're going to see that the icon over here, it's actually uh, with color, not anymore grayed out. Then we're going to go on YouTube and we're going to do the same. We're going to use our account to connect. If you're streaming on Kik, uh, you can go on Kik as well. Uh, the other two, it's not mandatory to actually do it. These are totally optional. Uh, I'm I never going to use them. So after you activated the uh, YouTube and Twitch, uh, what you need to do now is go over here on the short URL. You can also uh, activate this uh, checkbox over here. This will gonna be uh, basically your channel. Sometimes will gonna be posted on uh, their website. So we're gonna show which actually channels are using their uh, their widget. So after that, you're gonna copy over here your link and we will gonna go on our OBS sorry for the infinity over there but I'm recording at the same time so over here we will gonna go and add the browser the emotable And we're gonna place the resolution of our canvas, which is uh, 2560 by 1440. And of course, on the URL, you're gonna place the URL that you just copied. Click OK. And after that, you're gonna see that you are connected. We're gonna show on the top left over here some uh, that you are connected on Twitch and also on YouTube. And when you're gonna go on Twitch to actually test it out, I'm gonna go in the chat. I already tested it out a bit, quite a bit. And we will gonna post the same emotes there. Now we're gonna show 
basically on the screen. On YouTube, if you have your monetized and uh, you're having uh, like your own special emotes, uh, you're gonna have to do uh, another topic. I'm gonna have to go back on the emote homepage. Let's zoom in a bit. And over here, there is a hacky method for supporting YouTube monetized channel emotes. It's available through this URL over here. So we're gonna click it. And after that, uh, you're gonna see here uh, view source from whatever URL. This URL will gonna be your live chat. In order to get your live chat, uh, you're gonna go on your YouTube channel and you're gonna go live. We're not going live, but over here on the stream side, if you click it, then you're having basically always a live stream prepared, even if we're not going currently live. And on the top here, you have your video. After the video slash, you're gonna have the video uh, basically unique ID. We're gonna copy that. We're gonna go back to uh, emoji DB and we're gonna insert the URL over here. After doing that, we're going to go and open this uh, web page, which is basically your live chat into a different URL. And as you can see, we already have some emotes over there already posted. Uh, when you're here, you're going to press Control plus U to go and see your uh, source of the page and we're going to copy everything that we have over here going back to the db here in the source code we're going to paste it and this automatically we're going to find our uh, emotes that we added so far so all of them are here we're going to submit them and now we're totally fine when somebody actually used those emotes in our live stream uh they will gonna be used and shown on the screen. Hope this uh, tutorial was uh, helpful as well. And uh, we're gonna see each other on the next one. Bye everybody.